Hi, Mimi. Happy birthday. I wish we could be celebrating in person with you right now, uh, but I wanted to send you a little video note anyway. For the past 30 years, you've been an incredible grandmother to me, as well as a person who inspires me in countless ways. There's the classic Jewish grandmother stuff, like always offering me food to eat, even when I repeatedly decline it. In college, though, you and Pops would literally drive to the grocery store to buy a toasted ravioli and drop it off for me at school. Not every Jewish grandmother does that. You've been a wonderful support to me in the good times, always with questions and even ideas about the work I'm doing. You've been a support in tougher times, checking in on my health and buying me a keyboard when I needed some post-breakup distraction. You've also been an inspiration to me. Long after your retirement, you started a jewelry business. You've designed wonderful pieces that fetch top dollar for charity. You call Apple and find a representative who sends me a free MacBook when I can barely find a phone number. Thank you for always caring about our well-being and happiness. Thank you for being so supportive and loving. Thank you for making sure we always have enough deli meat when we visit St. Louis. Happy birthday, Mimi. I love you. Happy birthday, Mimi. Uh, you've always made me feel so welcome and comfortable, and I've always really appreciated that. Uh, Max often tells me that I remind him of you, and I take that as such a big compliment because from the get-go, it's been clear to me uh, that you are such a strong-willed, caring, and incredible woman. Uh, I've come to admire you a great deal, even in the limited time and limited format that we've gotten to know each other. Uh, I look forward to hopefully meeting you in person someday soon, uh, and I also look forward to being your ally in the thermostat debate. Uh, I hope you have a really great birthday.